okay dear students let us see what is there in this question a simple pendulum has a time period t on earth the pendulum is now taken to moon where the gravitational field strength is 1 by 6 that of the earth what is the time period of the pendulum on the moon so what is the time period of the pendulum on the moon okay so for this uh, first of all we must know the formula for the time period of a pendulum and it is given by 2 pi root of l by g okay and uh, this will be the I, i'm just calling it t1 because it is the um or, or earth okay yeah time period on earth and the time period on moon will be 2 pi and the length is not changed but the gravitation is changed it is g by 6 so it means 6 will go into the numerator and overall only root 6 is multiplied so you can just uh, replace everything like this te will be replaced here so you can always say that a will be the answer the time period on the moon will be root 6 times the time period on earth so it means that if the gravity is lesser the time period will increase definitely okay so this is how we do it and um, here I have another piece of information for you which might help you in coming exam like what is the time period of a pendulum in a satellite now if the same pendulum is taken into a satellite the time period will become infinite why because the gravity in a satellite we take it to be zero we take it to be zero it's not uh, an a space where there is no gravity or there is no gravitational force no gravitational force is there but because everything is falling uh, and you can experience weightlessness in space because everything is falling at the same rate everything is falling towards earth that's why we say that overall the gravity will be taken as zero there and so the time period of the pendulum in the satellite will become zero okay so my dear students this is professor Varun. please subscribe to the youtube channel all the best bye